Yeah, they're gonna go bench, bench, Crobat. They're gonna bench, Crobat, boss scale. Yeah, every time. Easy. Are you looking for sealed product and singles? You can find it all on Channel Fireball. Please use my Tailmon affiliate code when checking out to help support my content. Looking for PTGO codes? Photon Store has all the latest sets and promos instantly delivered to your email. You can use Tailmon code when checking out for 5% off. If you're from Europe, Millipods Gaming has a wide array of sealed products, singles, and more. You can use Tailmon code when checking out for 5% off. Card Market is Europe's largest online marketplace for Pokemon cards. Whether you're looking for sealed product or singles, vintage or the latest sets, just follow the link in the description to find what you need. Want to show off your love for Tablemon? Check out my 2021 merch. These new hoodies and shirts are available on Amazon. Click on the link in the description to get yours. Welcome back to another episode of 50 Keys, 50 Decks. My shirt is white. So apparently the green is getting reflected. That's why you see me um, very weirdly. Um, playing Water Mew 3 today, not a bad start, right? Generally not a bad start for us. Uh, we're hoping for not even Scented Scorch, right? I don't, okay, it is Scented Scorch. I don't even know what I'm hoping for, honestly. I don't even know what I'm hoping for, but Choosing to go second is already um, a win-ish against Sentis Scorch in a way, I guess. And this hand's actually really solid. I'm actually liking my chances. Because they can never KO my Mewtwo on turn two, and I can actually KO them. Why? Okay, so let's go. Okay. Let's lead off with the Starmy GX, right? Let's lead off with the Starmy GX discard. And then we'll go ahead and quick pull away the Starmy for Mewtwo. And then we'll go ahead and quick pull away the I think I'm gonna quick pull away a crow I'm not happy about it, but it is what it is. For Snum. So we'll go that, we'll go that, we'll go like this, we'll go like this, and then we will crowbat for five to start off. Okay. Double energy switch is 100% not what you want to see to start off, but hey, it is what it is. Um, so the issue with attacking. would be that my energy could get discarded, so I might actually choose not to attack. Well, you know what? Can I grab a water to discard it? And I'm gonna uh, that it change. Let's go, yeah. So I want a Mewtree. So any quick ball, any, uh, why? <laughs> Okay, because of this, 40 damage, this is 60 times. 40 damage actually saves me on energy. Getting two energies is also really impactful. But if they choose to remove my energy, then that's super annoying, right? I mean, if they're choosing to remove my energy, then they're probably in trouble. I am down one switch and two of those, though. <sighs> I'm not going to. Just gonna star stream. If we play the energy removal game, then so be it. Right? So be it. I could end up finding an energy switch and then they could end up losing because of that. Both energy switches are in the deck. I can't shuffle. My, they are at the bottom, but I can't shuffle. Or are they? Did I shuffle? 
Yeah, he shuffled actually, so they're not at the bottom. They're actually not at the bottom. And I kind of want to power up Keldeo out of the blue, because they might not see it coming. Okay, they decide to switch. That's a passive move, right? I am okay with that. I am okay with that passive move. The music abruptly stops. Um, Fion, annoying, not the end of the world for sure. Okay, now they have a full bench. My Mewtwo cannot go down though, which is fantastic. So now there's a lot of merit to pairing up the Keldeo next turn. Okay, so there's a type null now. They haven't played a single welder yet. Maybe a Piploblasto is actually good. Okay, and they just passed. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. I really wish I didn't have to discard the Keldeo though. Well, I mean, my Mewtwo isn't threatened, so I generally, I think I should just bench the Keldeo. Yeah, I'm just gonna bench the Keldeo. Okay, well, I'm gonna lose these, so might as well just get it over with. I would have gotten that, which is fantastic. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and ice dance. And I need to do I need to return two energies. Not a big deal, right? Not a big deal. I think one here and one here makes sense. My Mewtwo cannot be KO'd. That is really key. Because five energies plus the base 40, like if they go welder, do double welder attached, five times four is 200 to 40. So I cannot be KO'd by Santa Scorch. Things are actually looking really good so far. Recent stamp will be the, the big issue for us, for sure. Which is why having Keldeo powered up is actually a really big deal. Which is why I probably shouldn't have returned that energy. All right, my play, if my hand sticks, might be to go boss, KO the Dene or Crobat and leave the Keldeo powered up. Because then they'll be forced to go boss, KO Keldeo. So I want to finish my turn. Yeah, I think I think that's it. I think that's it. I might KO Silvali instead. We'll see, but I just need as many energy as possible down. And I need to leave the Keldeo fully powered up, basically. Because then I just need to deal with one Santa Scorch. If I go boss. Unless they don't bench a Santa Scorch, then I'm complete. Oh, wow. Okay, well, never mind. Never mind. Huh. Okay, definitely evolving here. Um, definitely doing this. Okay, so how do I go about this to maximize my chances of winning? Pretty sure I get rid of this person. All right, so I have one, two, three, four, five. I need to return six energies. need to return six energies and I currently have five six seven eight so I'm gonna be left with two energies in play I think I'm Marty I take away the boss which essentially gave me the win this is a solid hand though could get more energy into play or I could save the bucket to draw more energy afterwards. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, I think I played the bucket. Yeah, there's one energy left. All right, so six energies going back into the deck, right? Rocket Splash, one, two, three, four, five and six. I think that's it. Six, oh wait, no. I almost overdid it. I just needed five because I did hit for 40 damage. That was some quick maths. That was some quick maths in my head. <laughs> that was some quick maths in my head. Are we going to do this? Are we actually going to do this? Right, there's a Senti Scorch. So the way my opponent can now KO me is through a Heatran, right? That is how I could get KO'd. And then if the Fion is active and I don't win next turn, I think that's okay. Though that was an argument not to use Marty because then I just like, I took away the win essentially from myself. Ooh, we see the GOAT. We see the goat. If they attack me with the goat and I'm left with only three, I'm, oh my gosh. And they use Fion? Well, they can't use Fion though if they want to kill the Mewtwo. I can two shot this guy though because I don't immediately lose. There it is. All right, so we got Marty. It's all right. We see the switch, it's all right. Okay. So Keldeo GX does 50 for each bench, that's 200, so not getting a KO, right? Mewtwo could get a KO if I play energy switch. I did discard energy switch. Uh, I could also just, I think my best play is to go quick wall, dead it change to try to find boss. You just immediately win. Wait, what? That doesn't make sense. What? Now I just need an energy. That doesn't make sense. They were protecting themselves from Keldeo GX's GX attack, but in, in doing so, now Mewtwo ruins them. Now I just need one energy, and I just put so many back, right? Okay, so let's do this. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's get the Mewtwo. Let's just research it away for now. And there's the energy. Wow, plus one. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, times six is definitely a KO. And we are on to the next round with Water Mew3. <sighs> Intense. Intense. All right, I'll see you in the next round. All right, on to round two with Water Mew3. Usually what happens is I win round one and then I get an unplayable hand round two. Pretty please, PTCGO, have mercy on me. <laughs> Pretty please, PTCGO, have mercy on me. Um, okay, my opponent chooses to go first and we have a playable hand. Oh my god. What? All right, we have a game. We're up against ADP, that is not good. Okay, hitting for 40 on the ADP will actually be very important. Hitting for 40 on ADP will actually be very, very important. With Starmie GX. That means we need one less energy in order to get a KO on them on turn two. We need, a, we need absolutely need to KO ADP on turn two. Absolutely, like it's not negotiable. 
If we do that, we have a chance. If we don't, oh my gosh, Vitality Band. They're playing Vitality Band. How many Vitality Bands are they playing? Because that allows Seishin to KO Mewtwo. Okay, they're gonna ball while they're gonna find out what deck we are. This Frost Moth is scary, right? This Frost Moth is scary to have right here. Best top deck would be something like a Cherish Ball. Right? Best top deck would be something like a Cherish Ball right here. Why would you wear Balloon Mobile and, and not Tatini? That's odd. That is actually very odd. Okay, so there's a station. Thankfully, it doesn't have the Vitality event though. Another thing that could happen is if I don't bench a the Dene, I mean, I need to stop the ultimate ray. I can't stop the GX, I need to stop the ultimate ray. Oh, ho, 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 ho. okay. Ah, the other Frost mod is prized though. I have two outs after this. Well, actually, it really sucks, but I'm gonna do it. It really sucks, but I'm going to do it. I'm not happy about doing this though. Absolutely not happy about doing that. But hey, we'll take this. We will absolutely take this. Okay, so I'm gonna cherish for another Mewtwo. I'm gonna go ahead and bench it. I'm gonna bench this Nom. Gonna attach. I'm gonna star stream. We have the Frost Moth. We have Dig with Crobat and the Dene. Even, we're even sort of protected against crushing hammers? There's no way, right? There's a solid chance that we win this match now. There's a solid chance we win this match. I'm nervous. <laughs> I am very nervous. It still comes down to them though, I'm pretty sure. Well, depending on what I bench though. And depending on how many vitality vans they have too. <laughs> if they have two vitality vans or they have Leon as well or even Sixagon, then we're in trouble. I mean, and this is all assuming I can keep a constant stream of KOs, right? Which is not guaranteed either. So it's gonna be an uphill battle, but it's possible. It actually is very possible that we pull this off. Okay, they're researching a male saucer and they're down three bosses orders, what? And two stations too. That research felt very unnecessary. Okay, here we go. Now it comes down to energies. Now it comes down to energies. I have seven energies in the deck and four buckets. I only need two energies. I need one bucket. Is it possible that I actually with this? It is possible. It certainly is possible. All right, just grab the den, yeah? It's full on dig mode. So let's go Crobat. There's all the energies we need. There's all the energies we need. Uh, 
And I don't even need to bench that Danny. What is happening? Okay, so I didn't get any more energies. And that is going to be a problem. So I will have to dig with the crowbat. Oh wait, no, not not with the crowbat. Never mind, <laughs> not with the crowbat. <laughs> not with the crowbat. I'm gonna dig with the day. I think that's fine. Yeah. I absolutely think that's fine. We're gonna air balloon this guy. <sighs> Perfect. Beautiful. 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 And I don't think I want to use the Viridian Forest. No, I will, I will. Four times six, 24, 24. Boop boop goes the ADP. Boop boop goes the ADP, four guard hand, the Dene down, Crobat down, three bosses down, a metal saucer down. Have we done it? That is the question. And I have an air balloon on my Mewtwo, so if my Mewtwo takes a hit, I can actually return to the other Mewtwo. And this is what is really weird. If that had been on the Denet, then my opponent would actually like pressure me with Mobile, maybe? I don't know. But that feels really weird. Like a really weird choice by my opponent. Like a really weird choice. He's guaranteed energy thanks to my stadium. But it's part of the process, you know? Part of the process. <sighs> part of the process. See attachment on the station. We could see a KO on a Mewtwo, for sure. Right? We absolutely could see a KO on a Mewtwo if they play another Vitality event. They've already revealed one. This is not open deck list, so we don't know. We'll see. We shall see. So I left two energies on the active as well, because if I can actually use Keldeo GX's GX attack in order to um, get a KO next turn, then that keeps all the energy in play. And that is all we want. Energy in play means guaranteed chaos. That's all we need. If the energy doesn't get shuffled, then that's all we need. Right, so my opponent just did it changed away. A bunch of energies, a switch, an energy switch. <sighs> They're struggling. They're definitely struggling. You know? And even Amarni isn't terrible here. Okay, that's annoying. But not the end of the world by any means. Because if they're, if they're actively going for a Frostmoth, then it's fine. That's like, a, I'll play this card whilst I give myself more time to think if there's any chance of me pulling off anything here. Okay, so we see the Eldegoss. For research, it's not boss, so they're not trying to stall me out, which is fantastic. Go for research. Wow, they're playing double mobile. What even is this list? One, two. Double mobile, vitality band, five energies down, six total out of eight, you would assume. Triple the Dene, double mobile, three stations, two ADPs, one Eldegoss, Crobat. There's the saucer. Now I can GX KO anything? Oh, you're kidding. You actually have a second Vitality event. <laughs> of course you do, man. Of course you do. Did they whiff the saucer? One must be priced, right? Oh, they whiffed the saucer. Thank you. They actually do play two Vitality events. That is insane. That is insane. Okay, so... 
here's what we do. We're gonna do this. Grab the Keldeo. We're gonna do this. They clearly don't play Crushing Hammers, right? We're gonna do this so I can GX KO the mobile and keep energy in play. Oh no, that's a mistake. Like all of these cards are good, right? Yeah, this works. Pretty sure this works. Are they gonna play Reset Stamp as well? Imagine they go Yelgrunt KO. What even is that list, man? Double Vitality Band, double Mobile? What even is that list? Now I'm worried. Forsation? How do they fit all of this? They played one research. How many researches do they actually play? Okay. That was to be expected. It's good enough. That is absolutely good enough. That's game, right? 240. That's four energies. That is game. <sighs> Second Vitality Band, dude. Second Hacking Vitality Band. Second Hacking Vitality Band. Okay, just to be extra safe. I know I always complain when people do this, but I'm just making sure I'm not forgetting something really hacking weird, you know? Three, five times six, 300. <sighs> Good to go to the final match. Let's go. Alrighty, against SS Marriott's. I was not expecting. I don't know what I was expecting. I'm just taking it in stride at this point. Trying to keep the raging under control. Okay, I want the coin flip. I'm gonna choose to go second. Fire sleeves, fire deck box, but. Um, this the um, the ADP coin so we don't know we don't know what we're up against and it's eternities oh my gosh okay Ugh. I mean it's not the worst thing but it's not great either and they have six seconds. That means power plant, doesn't it? They're gonna be playing power plant, aren't they? They got such a perfect start too. They're gonna be playing power plant, you just know it. You just know I'm playing legendary mode. <sighs> okay. I 100% do not expect them to um, I 100% do not expect them I don't know what I was going to say Like I I'm, I'm thinking about the bosses in my hand I'm pretty sure I don't like I'm not going to have them here Okay, so I got the energy. I do need to bench this second person. I'll keep the stadium, right? So I'm not gonna use Viridian because all the cards in my hand are pretty good. And we'll go Starstream.
Losing the double boss, man. Losing the double boss is very annoying. Okay, so I need them to whiff KO. Do need them to whiff KO. did with KO, that is insane. That is actually insane. <laughs> oh, two energies, why do I draw two energies right here? Okay. You're kidding, I have three energies left. <laughs> you are kidding me, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, that is KO. <laughs> that is KO. That also gets rid of all my energies. Two, three, four, five, six. <clears throat> oh, wait, what? Oh, I didn't need to get rid of all of them all. Oh, I'm so stupid. I forgot it had 40 damage on it. I'm gonna. I should absolutely get punished for that. That was so dumb. That was actually so dumb. Ah, oh, that was so dumb, Paolo. That was actually so dumb of me. That was actually so dumb of me. Ugh. Okay, they already committed energy there, so they're not KOing me, right? They are absolutely not KOing me this turn. Ugh. How many bosses are they down? Zero bosses down. Great. Fantastic. Zero bosses down. Zero bosses down. I'm dead, aren't I? Okay, well. What, how does the saying go? No use oh, crying over spilt milk, I guess. My last boss is also priced. <laughs> My last boss is also priced. Yeah, I am super dead. Oh. 
That double boss loss, man. Every time. I can't catch a freaking break. This could have easily been plus five now. And they have crushing hammers left too. Psst. How have they not lost a single boss? That is what I don't understand. That is definitely what I don't understand. I don't even have enough energies left. to KO that guy, I don't think. I have one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I don't think I have enough energies left anyways. Yeah, they're gonna go bench, bench, Crobat. They're gonna bench, Crobat, boss KO. Yeah, every time, easy. If they got the boss under using building spite. Energy switch. I need energy switch. Oh my god, I need energy switch. Please, there. Is the energy switch even available? I don't even know. <laughs> oh wait, I'm down all three bosses. Never mind. I thought I had one left. It's my energy switch prized. It's not prized. Oh my god. Seven cards I can't whiff because I have Marnie left. Oh. Plus five with this? What the heck? With my misplay too. And I wouldn't have needed the energy switch if I had kept the energy attached because I didn't need to do 360 damage because I already had 40 damage on it. What? How is this a plus five? How did I get plus five with it? Well, take it. I'm very happy. I'm very happy that I got a plus five. Wow. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. All right. Thanks so much for tuning in. Don't forget to leave a like. I'll see you next time.